And we start this newscast with some breaking news. A train runs off the tracks in rural Canyon County. KBOI 2's Sierra Ashran joins us live now to explain exactly what happened. Sierra. The Caldwell Fire Department is saying this is all happening because of the weather. Now, fortunately, nobody was hurt, but they're just trying to get the train back onto the tracks now. Caldwell Fire says it could be a couple of days before they find a crane to hoist the engine. Fortunately, none of the other cars derailed. And I have been here for a couple of hours, and Highway 19 is moving pretty smoothly, but there have been a few people just to stop and pull over, taking pictures of this lopsided locomotive. Reporting live in Greenleaf, Sierra Oshrin, KBOI 2 News. And a semi-truck blocked traffic on the interstate this morning after it tipped over. This happened near the Garrity exit in Nampa. It is still causing headaches for drivers. Now at one point today, it closed all lanes on the eastbound side of the freeway. Troopers say the semi flipped after the driver of a truck slammed into it while it was trying to merge onto the freeway. Another car was struck by debris. The driver of the truck was taken to the hospital. No word on her condition. And let's take a live look at the roads right now. Here is uh, I-84 at 11th. Boy, slow going out there. The roads don't look bad, maybe a little bit wet. We'll have to uh, check in with Roland in a couple of minutes and see if there's a chance of any refreezing tonight as the uh, temperatures drop.